Kalmani Cat vs Turkish Angora Cat What are the differences between these two cat breeds? The Kalmani is a natural cat breed, which means they developed without the need for human intervention. These felines are known for being energetic, smart, and sociable. The Kalmani has built up a reputation as an outgoing and athletic cat who loves to take part in lengthy play sessions. The breed is a great fit for families with children or other pets, as this is a kitty who will always want to seek out friends and persuade them to start another playtime session. Loneliness can be an issue for these cats, so they do best in active and busy households. Once the Turkish Angora gets an idea into his head, it can be difficult to change his mind about how he should behave, but he is so charming that you probably won't care. The Cow Mani is a white cat. The breed's plain white coat also has the effect of making their eyes stand out and sparkle. When it comes to grooming, most Cow Mani cats are very low maintenance because this is such a short-haired cat, you can get by brushing them just once a week. This will help lessen the likelihood of hairballs and mats forming. In terms of climate, the Cow Mani generally prefers to be around warmer temperatures rather than cold ones. Although you should always make sure that there are enough shade and fresh water available during the hotter months. The Turkish Angora is best known for its long, fine, silky coat, which seems to shimmer as it moves. The length of the coat varies, with the longest hair usually seen in the ruff around the neck, the breeches on the upper hind legs, and the plume tail. You may think of an Angora as being solid white, but the coat can also be other solid colors as well as tabby, tortoise shell, calico, or other patterns. Beneath the coat is a body that is firm, long, and muscular. Legs are long, with the hind legs being longer than the front legs, and the paws are small, round, and dainty, often with tufts of fur between the toes. The long tail tapers from a wide base to a narrow end. Contributing to the cat's beauty is a small to medium-sized wedge-shaped head with large ears that sit high on the head and are tufted with fur and large almond-shaped eyes that slant slightly upward. The eyes can be blue, green, gold, amber, or odd, one blue eye and one green, green gold, or amber eye. When it comes to the Kalmani's personality, you'll instantly realize that this is one super playful and curious cat. This breed will happily play fetch games and never think twice about exploring every nook and cranny of an environment so make sure you have at least one cat tree installed for the kitty and preferably lots of safe furniture that can be scaled. The breed bonds well with children and other small pets, and will quickly become your kid's best new playmate. Adding on to the Kalmani's playful side, this is a sociable cat who always wants to be at the center of any action going on. If your home is empty for large parts of the day, the cat could suffer from loneliness. In fact, Kalmanis have also become known for being very talkative and verbal kitties so be prepared for many back and forth conversations with your new feline friend. Beautiful and elegant on the surface, the Turkish Angora can surprise an unsuspecting owner with his athleticism and intelligence. No bookcase is too high for him to reach the top, and no closed door is safe from being opened by his questing paws. While he certainly can have lovely manners Turkey, as he is sometimes nicknamed, has an active, boisterous side to his nature, with a cleverness that makes him endlessly entertaining. He likes to play and will do whatever is necessary to get and keep your attention, even if it means getting into a little trouble. The Angora keeps his kitten-like playfulness well into old age. He is friendly toward guests but loves his own people best. This is a sociable breed that is best suited to a home where he will have another cat or a dog to keep him company if people aren't home during the day. When you are home, the Angora may drape himself across your shoulders or settle comfortably into your lap. At night you're likely to find him next to you with his head resting on your pillow. To live happily with a turkey, you should have a sense of humor that matches his own, as well as a good store of patience. Once he gets an idea into his head, it can be difficult to change his mind about how he should behave but he is so charming that you probably won't care. If you will, it's best to consider another breed. This is an affectionate, gentle cat who is devoted to his family, but his precocious intelligence, resourcefulness, desire for interaction and play, and short attention span may make him a challenge to live with. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. It's hard to accomplish this nutritional requirement by providing only dry food as most commercially available dry food contains a lot of carbohydrates, fillers, plant protein, and other ingredients that are not natural for a cat to eat. More often than not, the bag will claim that the dry food is well balanced and provides complete nutrition, but in reality, nothing could be further from the truth. Another important consideration is your cat's water intake. Cats in the wild get most of their hydration from their diet, not by actually drinking water as most people think. Canned cat food is about 70-80% to 80 water, 
while dry food is only about 10% water. It's important to keep up your cow money's regular veterinary checkups to detect any health concerns early. Your vet can help you develop a care routine that will keep your cat healthy. For such an active cat, the cow money definitely needs to be provided with enough space to be able to run around and satisfy their exercise needs. The Turkish Angora has a single coat with a silky texture. Because there's no undercoat to cause mats or tangles, it's easy to groom with weekly combing or brushing, and it sheds very little. The coat doesn't achieve its full length until the cat is approximately two years old. Brush the teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily dental hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Trim the nails every couple of weeks. Wipe the corners of the eyes with a soft, damp cloth to remove any discharge. Use a separate area of the cloth for each eye so you don't run the risk of spreading any infection. Check the ears weekly. If they look dirty, wipe them out with a cotton ball or soft damp cloth moistened with a 50 to 50 mixture of cider vinegar and warm water. Avoid using cotton swabs, which can damage the interior of the ear. Keep their litter box spotlessly clean. Cats are very particular about bathroom hygiene, and a clean litter box will also help to keep the long coat clean. It's a good idea to keep a cow mani and Turkish Angora as an indoor-only cat to protect them from diseases spread by other cats, attacks by dogs or coyotes, and the other dangers that face cats who go outdoors, such as being hit by a car. Cow mani and Turkish Angoras who go outdoors also run the risk of being stolen by someone who would like to have such a beautiful cat without paying for it. The cow mani is a great fit with young children, not least because the breed is so outgoing and playful. Just be sure that early socialization takes place and boundaries are properly set on both sides and supervise early interactions between kids and cats. When it comes to other household pets, the cow money fares well with many domestic animals, including dogs. Always supervise early interactions between the new cat and existing pets as well. The Angora who has been well socialized is comfortable with kids, making him a good choice for families who will supervise children to make sure they pet the cat nicely and don't pull his fur or tail. He is happy to live with cat-friendly dogs, too, as long as they recognize that he's in charge. Ultimately, early socialization really pays off with this breed. Make sure to reward your cow money and Turkish Angora for good behavior when you bring them home to your family. Introduce pets slowly and in controlled circumstances to ensure that they learn to get along together. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.